So, old Queenslander, gloss enamel ceilings, gloss enamel walls. So, how do you prepare them? This is how you do it. Oil based undercoat. Doesn't have to be this one, this is a quick dry, but doesn't have to be this one. It can be oil based undercoat. As long as it's oil based undercoat. Just going to scrape you through here and then do a scratch test. Now, I'll try and find a room. All this was gloss enamel. One coat, no preparation. As you'll see there, that's gloss enamel. Uh, gloss enamel, shiny. One coat, four based undercoat. I don't care how hard you scratch, you will not mark it. No preparation, no sanding, just straight into it. This is the round of power point, so this is actually a really hard place. Normally you've got to re-sand all this. Watch. Just can't do it. I'll find some more for you. Old Masonite. Impossible. Stains come through. One coat of oil based undercoat. Now yeah, you can see the sheen on that one. That is shiny. Finish yesterday afternoon. So this cupboard being pulled out of here. This laundry tub's been moved over. Gloss enamel. It's impossible to hurt it. You will not scratch it off. I don't know, I've just got to try and show you how shiny that is. That gloss enamel, old gloss enamel, 30 years old. No prep work, straight on. So all these doors here, it's all the gloss enamel, will just be sprayed now with an oil based undercoat. Those doors up there will be sprayed with oil based undercoat and then finished off with normal stuff. All this was full of cupboards. So, secret, secret to painting over old gloss enamel, oil based undercoat, one coat, no prep work. You do your prep work afterwards. This is the time that you can fix holes, sand the walls, you can do all that afterwards. And uh, cobwebs, stuff like that, old grease, all these ceilings up here. Look at that light. Now, if I could get up there. Look at the stain, the fly shit, the fat, oil based undercoat. You put a coat of oil based undercoat on. See, this, this is in a kitchen. This is a terrible spot. Watch. This was the range hood. Fat. You can see all the, all the fine stuff on it. Like this, there's a lot of foreign articles on there. No prep work, no washing, no nothing, just oil based undercoat. So if you have an old house, old rental, and you want to clean it up, you don't want to spend a whole week washing it down, scrubbing it down, sanding it down, then undercoating it, just don't do it. Just oil based undercoat, then you do your prep work. Catch you later. Bye.